Hi, this is Risa, and this is Inconvenient Interviews with Risa and Hello Giggles. Today I am interviewing model and actor Peter Porte. He's basically the fiercest man around, and he's doing a photo shoot, so I'm just going to try to get in there. Fashion. Hey, Peter. Did you know that you're on a website called themostbeautifulmen.com? I didn't know that, no. Uh oh. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I don't do the camera. What's the funnest part about being on set? Uh, I think working with great people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, that's about what I thought I would say. <laughs> Peter. How important are cheekbones? They're everything, Risa. They're everything. That's what I thought. I was you just checking. Thanks. They're the same as my mom's. How do you get that messy but not thing? Well, you have to start by being perfectly gorgeous, and then you mess up your hair a little bit so that you look a little less gorgeous, but you still have to look gorgeous. Okay, so it's like you're gorgeous, and then you want to show people you're human, so you like tossle your bangs. Just so you can still make friends. Cool. Oh my god, that's in my eye. That girl's vicious. On the show Baby Daddy, you play twins. Their names are Brad and Tad. How do you differentiate those characters? Like, do you ever feel psychotic playing twins? No. You differentiate them. One has glasses and a pocket square and one doesn't. It's like Phoebe and <laughs> Ursula. What was the number one most stressful part about working on a soap opera? <clears throat> This is way more stressful than any anything I've done in soap. Doing this interview right now? Yeah. It's really stressing me out. Can you show me your best catwalk? <clears throat> Let's do it together. Okay. Can we get I'm a not beat? very good. Well, Peter, it seems time to go to the pool and see you in your next, as they call it in the fashion world, look. I am really looking forward to seeing your abs today. It's, oh my god, he's drowning. Oh my god, he's just Model down! It's so hard with models, you never know if they're drowning or just having fun. Your mom is Polish and your father is Italian. Is that hard? Having two European parents that never uh, experienced Thanksgiving until they were in their 20s and they moved here. They didn't quite know, you know, the ins and outs of it, like that you need a turkey. One Thanksgiving, we just, um, we didn't have a turkey. We had pasta. Peter, it's been said about you that when you get nervous, you enjoy the sound of a vacuum cleaner recorded. <laughs> this is true, yeah. Um, and for, you know, um, this is true. It's true. Alone in this. Until recently, come down here. Until recently, I, um, went online and I just typed in vacuum cleaner sounds. And there are like hours and hours and hours of YouTube videos of vacuum cleaning. I like seeing this side of him, the naked side. <laughs> Here, 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 here. Yeah, pull and then the wig. Yeah, and then pull wig off. Snap pee birth. Snap pee birth. That's a snappy birth. That's a quick one, like an induced sleep. Oh my god, it's, it's too bright. Bite my nails. We're gonna bite those nails. Yes. I go from right to the chair. styles of acting. I'm going to give you the line, and you've worked in all these different, like, worlds. Musical theater. And the line is, Risa, what I wouldn't give to spend one more night with you. <clears throat> Risa, what I wouldn't give to spend just one more night with you. Now soap opera. Risa, what I wouldn't give to spend just one more night. Hold me. Oh, no. You always have to compliment models, because believe it or not, some of them are really sad inside. And um, 
They're just like normal, regular people. Like, they need compliments. I love your rippling muscles. Thanks, Risa. Like, that made him feel better. What are you most recognized for? Are you that guy from the new normal? Are you, because um, you did like a strip tease in the new normal, are you that guy from every ad in the world? Are you th that guy from Young and the Restless? Are you that guy from the Pepsi commercial with Sofia Vergara? It's for the way you look at me. Oh, it's for the only one. It's mostly Young and the Restless um, or Baby Daddy. And... It depends on who it is. If it's like a tween girl, it's baby daddy. But if it's oh. like a kind of <clears throat> 50, 60-year-old Russian man, it's almost always the young and the restless. And he always has something very important to tell me about what's going on currently on the show. And are you like, you know what? I don't want to know because I'm not on it anymore. No, I always am very interested. Really? Yeah. Are you nice to your fans? You have to be. They're nice to you. Handsome, normal person. And you're beautiful, and where's your face? Nice, take a shot. Drown yourself. One kiss before I go. Oh, God, that was open mouth. I hated that. But I guess it was from a model, so I should be grateful. Peter, you did a great job today. Thank you. Yeah. Um... On a scale of 1 to 10, how do you think I did as an interviewee? Modeling, 110. Interviewee, 4 to 3. 4 to 3? Percentage. Jeez. Percent. Yeah. Out, of, out of 100 percent. So yeah. not very well. Well, what could I do next time to be better? I would love to tell you, Peter, but this hot tub is getting to my head. And I feel like I'm slowly talking harder now. Here, let me take that microphone. This is Peter Porte for Inconvenient Interviews. Uh, signing off. Thank you for watching again. <laughs> Peter Porte, Inconvenient Interviews with Hello Giggles. Good night and good luck.